Welcome back to my channel once again, ladies and gentlemen. How's it going, everybody? I hope you guys are all having a spectacular day. Today, I'm getting into a Treasure Studios art unboxing and unbagging. I'm only going to do one painting and show you what's in the bag. So, this did come wrapped up in this to protect it, but that it also is in... The box, which is inside of another box. Let me see which painting I'm going to show you guys. I think I'm going to show you guys this painting. Let me pull it out and get this out of the way. There we go. Nice, beautiful box. So I'm going to push that back real quick and we're going to get into this bag. So this is something that I seen Miss Yvonne unbox or show on Instagram, and I was like, oh my god, this is beautiful, why haven't I seen this? Well, I was like, you know what, I need to go check them out, because I'm always writing down notes and stuff in books, and I was like, this would just be a, a perfect add-on to a book to, you know, write notes in, and all that fun jazz. So there is three different color versions in this that you can get. I believe I got the silver. There is bronze and copper. This is just absolutely beautiful. This is a nice hardbound book. Oh yeah. It's got black inside. And then as you come to the first book, it says notebook. And then you have nice, really nice pages. And I believe, yes, there is a couple of different colors of pages. So you have a bunch of these really nice cream colors. And then you have these really nice, like, old-fashioned looking. And I was just like, this book is absolutely gorgeous. I love the Phoenix. And then the, one of the best parts that I thought about it is it has this little string bookmark. So, wherever you're working at, you can just drop that down and you know exactly where you're working at. So, that's number one. Number two is this bad boy right here. This is also a new piece to the website. And when I seen it, I was like, oh my god, this is awesome. So, safety first. You unwrap it. I mean, this this is like legit, genuine leather. This feels like, wow, this is nice. And then, I don't know exactly. I mean, look at that. That's like really, really thick, handcrafted. Like, all, like this is all stamped. Like, look at, look at that beautiful tooling work. All right, so then you open it up. And then you have, like, a bunch of individual little spots. They're all sewn together on the end here. And they're just blank. And I was like, oh, yes, this is awesome. I can keep notes on this. I can keep, I could use this and use this as, like, my diamond painting journal. I could take, like, a sticker off of, like, that you'd get with your painting or take a copy of the picture of the sticker, put it in there, write in there what size it is that I want. These are absolutely awesome. I will, I don't know the price offhand. I don't, I can't remember, but I will put it in the description box of how much these were. I believe they were like 15 ish dollars. So incredibly, incredibly awesome price. Really, really like the craftsmanship. I mean, this this feels incredibly nice. So those are the two journaling pieces I got. Now let's get into this magnificent diamond painting. Let me set these off the side so I have a little bit more room. Okay, so you have Treasure Studios Art Box. This is the smaller edition of the box um, to make a little bit more room for... Uh, not room, but to maximize the space down that the box was using because before the boxes were a lot wider. 
gives you your contact information to Treasure Studios Art. Their P.O. Box, you need to get a hold of them. Facebook, Instagram, and Pinterest. Your six steps to diamond painting Treasure Studios Art Diamond Art Kit. And as we open it, bam. Set that like so. Let's get into this bad boy. We have a toolkit, which I will get into. And our diamonds. Ooh, I got this in a square. Nice. Nice. I may have to do start this one instead of the other one. I don't know. Still unsure. I'm going to start with one TSA square here real soon. Um, if you guys don't know what a TSA you may ask what TSA stands for. That is Treasure Studios Art. I always say TSA because it's just easier to abbreviate, you know. So, this. You have two chunks of wax. You have a three-placer and a six-placer. I know I've gotten a couple of kits that have had the newer thin-placers in them. This just may be an older um, toolkit. A pink squishy. A clear pin and the famous pink tweezers and they are nice rounded they do not hurt to stab so you might want to grab one of those eye gouging types of tweezers out there like like this eye gouging like eye gouging <laughs> like put the colander back on it because it will stab you and not care about your feelings. So you guys ready to see this? Now mind you, this is a Treasure Studios art. You never, ever, ever, ever want to roll your painting backwards. Always roll it face out. And never take it and roll it backwards like you would a Diamond Art Club. Or one of the other paintings. Because that can affect the mounted film adhesive that the canvas that your diamonds stick to. This is mounted film adhesive. This is like a combination of poured glue and double-sided adhesive. It has a really thick plastic cover compared to your normal like poured glue. Like it's a lot thicker. I really don't like pulling it back because I don't like air getting underneath of it. On on these, on, on literally any canvas, I do not pull it back. People ask all the time, well, you didn't do a sticky test. Well, I don't like pulling the plastic back because that puts air underneath of there. That puts bubbles underneath of there. And if you don't spend your time and push those bubbles out, they will. And they can come back and bite you in the ass. So this is an absolutely gorgeous piece by Michelle Tracy. Always Beside You by Michelle Tracy. This is a 50 by 70. This has 30 colors. Oh my god, this is absolutely gorgeous. This is my Native American guy and angel woman over here. She's got like angel wings. I... I I love this. Oh my gosh. Now, a lot of people try to roll these canvases. My biggest suggestion to you guys, if you want it to lay flatter, do not pull back that plastic. All you literally have to do is grab both ends and give it a little pull, like so. And that flattens it out really nicely. Just a little tug on both sides up and down the canvas just kind of helps stretch it out and look at that it's just it's just flat oh my god this is absolutely gorgeous oh man i think i'm still going to start my parrots first because those are like I, I love the parrots, but this one right here, oh my gosh, this one right here. Okay, let me get these diamonds out, and I will show you guys the color inventory sheet so you guys can see for yourselves what this is. So here is the picture, Michelle Tracy, oh my gosh, you 
have created a masterpiece of a painting. It's a Native American guy holding his angel woman with a raven over here. And then there's like the whole moon outline. Oh my gosh, just absolutely gorgeous. I got this in a square. Like I said, it has 30 colors. It does give you an option for rounds or crystal rhinestones. Um, not all canvases come in crystal rhinestones. If it doesn't show it on the website, message Rachel and ask her. She can probably help you out with that. All their information for social media. Really like the quality of the, of that. Okay, so let's just say, oh my god, will you look at that color? That is absolutely gorgeous. These squares look so freaking awesome. So I'm just going to set this over here to lay that corner flat. And I'm just going to lay them out so you guys can see them. Hold on. I'm going to set that there. Oh my god. Look at these colors. 38.45. You are stunning. 38.44. You are stunning. Whoo. This canvas is going to get me. I'm telling you. This canvas is going to get me. Just with the teals and the blues in this canvas. Oh my gosh. Absolutely stunning. 996 beautiful blue. All right, I'm just gonna throw these out real quick so you guys can have a peek at the colors yourself instead of sitting here showing you individually of what the colors are. Oh my gosh, look at those colors, you guys! Like, I think these two colors right here it doesn't even do justice. The camera is making them a lot darker than they are in my own eyes they're absolutely gorgeous teal colors this one's a little bit of a lighter teal and this is more of a this one's actually like an aqua-ish color and this one's more of a tealish turquoise absolutely gorgeous okay so let's see we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen eighteen twenty twenty one twenty two three four five six seven twenty eight nine thirty Got all the colors. Yay. Awesome sauce. Let's see. What is my darkest color here? The darkest color I have here is 823. There is no 310 in this canvas, which is really surprising me. But I'm just going to show you guys these diamonds. They absolutely look beautiful. They're flat, flat, flat. There are no misshapens. They're like really, really nice looking diamonds. Like, incredible looking diamonds. So, that is that. Let me put these diamonds up real quick and we'll go over. A little bit of a preview of the canvas once again just in case you guys didn't see it all the way and I'm just gonna nicely stack these up like so And don't forget the inventory sheet. Always got to have that handy. All right, let's take a look here. Look how crystal clear this canvas Are you going to focus? I 
I guess it's somewhat focusing. Man, this is going to be confetti, confetti, confetti. I can already tell, like, the, all, all of him and her are going to be, like, a lot of confetti. And then around them is going to be a con combined con combined of confetti and color blocking, which is absolutely going to be beautiful. So that's it for today's video, ladies and gentlemen. I thank you guys so much for coming back and watching. Mind you, I am an affiliate to Treasure Studios Art, so I have a discount code in the description for you guys. To use the link and make sure you use Jeremy15 for 15% at checkout on your order over $40. It will not work unless it's over $40, which that's pretty easy to do. So that's all for me, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you guys so much for coming back and watching. And if you are new here, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Ring the notification button our bell and click all so you know every time i post and it is monday wednesday and friday and live on saturday so i'll see you guys next time and have peace have love and respect for one another and have a wonderful day bye guys